Finland in a super cute spot called House of Small Wonder and we just had a really nice Japanese brunch and we just ordered some desserts and afterwards we're going to walk around and we'll show you everything that we're doing. I ordered some special Japanese cake which is great. Here is the cocktail. I also drank some matcha and it's one of the best matchas I've ever tried. Here's Danny. He's also enjoying a good cocktail. And if you guys go to Berlin, you have to visit the spot if you want some really nice food and a beautiful interior. I'll show you around. It's like one of the most unique places I have ever seen and yeah, the food is 10 out of 10. Right? The first time you were Don't shine when you're not near. I don't feel like I do when you're with me. It felt like suddenly our souls collided, hearts entwined. When I decided to make you mine, I'm never going back. I know that's a fact, but how do I know? If it's love that I'm speaking of This is love if I'm making you back We decided to go on a boat tour And yeah, I think it's about one hour long and we're going to discover everything The river's name is Spree This is love if I feel myself coming down You're not around If I think I've gone crazy This is love If it seems I don't care at all that On this beautiful boat trip We managed to put together some pieces of information Like it was a puzzle Because we don't speak German But we can tell you that Norman Foster The British architect Maybe the most famous British architect Built this So it's like an office building And you can see that the designs are pretty similar To what he does A lot of glass um, and a lot of stone and he is the designer who made the shard in London so you can see some similarities there and um, we saw some Victoria it was called the Victoria Gardens so based on Queen Victoria and now I'm being rudely interrupted so I'm just gonna that's my cue to be quiet I used to worry about my options worry about my options yeah I used to think too much I finished the boat tour and we're walking around the center of the city the sun is shining it's beautiful we're very happy and excited to be here it's a wonderful city we recommend it to everyone you will find something you like here for sure I think right now we are going to go back home and work a little bit and after that we are going to dinner at 8 o'clock at a Georgian restaurant it's going to be the first time we tried Georgian food, so we're excited. I'm curious if it's similar to the Bulgarian one. So we'll rate everything and tell you about the food and the restaurant. We got super lucky that the weather is so amazing right now because Berlin can get extremely cold. We are currently at a really nice Georgian restaurant called Ambavi. We just sat down and ordered some starters and the salad really reminds us of the traditional Bulgarian salad and we are going to share like a few different vibes. Here's Danny. Touch me now, yeah, that's
is so good like I'm shocked like every single dish that we have tried so far at the table like we already have a lot of stuff but everything is like better than the next thing like, I'm just super impressed I like the salad a bit more than the Bulgarian one because of the walnut taste like it makes such a huge difference and it's just so good Wow. Mm. It's so good. I love this little paste. I don't know what it has, but it's incredible. Mm. Wow. She move that body. I swear I never seen nobody. Get that shoe on to party. Baby, won't you come my way? The way she move that body. Get that shoe on to party. I swear I never seen nobody. Maybe up until this day. Beautiful girl, my goddess. The way she built the shot it. But she closed the fortress. Baby, don't you be afraid. We've been through a lot of problems. But now come the time to solve them So I say don't you worry I'm gonna treat you right Baby girl I don't change But this ain't the case Cause when I see your face I just want you back on my grip I'm telling you it's okay Wanna make you forget All about the best So just give me a chance yeah, yeah. The way she moved that body I swear I never seen nobody that you want to party Baby, won't you come my way The way she move that body Get that you want to party That's why I never seen nobody Maybe up until this day I come in with the mood When nobody but you You know I like to grow And I know you too Girl, I think about you Straight out of the blue Don't know what you do That gets me in the mood if I had a choice, it would always be you That's the only joke, so just to make it come true Oh, oh, just to make it come true Baby, why won't you stay? What more can I say? You're my only right way Every night, every day hey. No, I won't let this fade I'ma tell you just straight you're everything I need, so let me be your slave The way she moved that body I swear I never seen nobody Who does you want to party? Baby, won't you come on? Good morning, guys! Hey, guys! It is the next day and we're visiting the East Side Gallery and the Berlin Wall and checking out all the graffiti. Super interesting. This is my favorite wall. <laughs> we have, like, a joke that Every time we speak on the vlog, we say that this is our favorite thing. But yeah, it's super interesting. And today is again committed to sightseeing and checking everything around. And we're kind of lucky that the weather is not too bad right now. There is still some sun, although it's quite cold. Hey guys, I want to tell you a story. We're here with the small kangaroo. 
and we're at Brandenburg Square. So over here, you can see the French Embassy. And on the symmetrical other side, over here, somewhere, there, is the US Embassy. But what's really interesting is that this monument over here was taken by Napoleon in 1806 when he conquered Germany and Berlin and he brought it back to France as a token of his uh, victory and then when he got defeated by the Russians the Germans took it back and put it back up there which is quite impressive considering that it was 220 years ago um, how did they do that? I don't know but yeah and it symbolizes the reunitedness of Berlin and it's the monument that represents it the most because um, for many years, I think for almost 20 years, this was not accessible to visitors or tourists or locals. No one, no one could basically visit the Brandenburg Square. Um, after the fall of the wall, the people came here for New Year's Eve and there was a hundred thousand uh, citizens from both Berlin East and Berlin West and they celebrated uh, New Year's together and it was a huge party and it was great and the emotions were very positive and happy and, and therefore this is the most representative monument of the unitedness of the country. This over here with the green roof, it looks very much like Parisian hotels, the Osmanian style. These um, hotels are very representative of two, three centuries ago and this particular hotel is the Hotel Adlon Kempinski and it is possibly the most iconic one in Berlin. Um, extremely famous, many stories have happened in that hotel, around the hotel, and it is obviously a five-star hotel, very exclusive, premium.
finished the breakfast. It was so delicious. Yeah. And now uh, we're going to go to Charlottenburg Palace. And yeah, I'm very excited to see it's a Rococo style castle. And there is a very famous room there. I think it's called the Amber Room. And yeah, I've been really wanting to go to this castle, so I'm glad Danny <laughs> finally got convinced to I go. gave in. Yeah. <laughs> I gave in. So yeah, let's go to the palace. It is Sunday today. It's our last full day in Berlin because tomorrow we're leaving in the afternoon. And right now I'm alone. Danny's uh, still sleeping. And I went out to meet a friend of mine. She's a Bulgarian girl as well. And we're about to have some lunch. So I'll show you the restaurant and the food and everything. And basically the plan for today is just to walk around, explore some local spots. I really want to go to a super cute uh, magazine place where they sell like amazing fashion magazines. The plan for today is to go to the Dark Matter exhibition. I booked tickets for 7 o'clock and right after the exhibition we're going to go to dinner. Look, we're exploring Berlin on a Sunday. Everything is so nice and so beautiful. And we got very lucky with the weather because right now it's 15 degrees, so I think that's pretty good for Berlin. And yeah, today is like the big marathon, so uh, the footage that I'm going to show you, it's everyone is running and basically the city is completely blocked. So when there are marathons as big as this one, it's a better idea to either walk what I'm doing right now or take the metro because otherwise it's impossible and also uh, I heard a kid talking and she was like guys don't go sightseeing on Sunday when there is the marathon because everything will be closed and I think she was right so I'm happy we did all of the sightseeing the days before I took some outfits today hopefully I'll be able to change and shoot because I'm doing a collab with a fashion brand so I would love to shoot the content here in Berlin let me just check my Google map to see how far I am okay perfect I'm only three minutes away from the restaurant I'm starving you guys I'm so hungry like yesterday um, 
We went to dinner at a very nice restaurant called Frederick, Frederick's and uh, it was great. I got the salmon, it was super delicious, but I think like the portion was a bit small and that's why this morning like I woke up hungry as a wolf. So I'm quite hyped to eat. Just came to the restaurant, it's called Laos Bengio. I don't know if I'm pronouncing this right, but you can see it here. And I'm just waiting for my friend. I'm really wondering what should I take. If I should get the eggs benedict or the crazy chicken waffle. Both of them sound so good and I'm so hungry. I feel like I can eat everything right now. And I just ordered some coffee so I'm waiting for it. And my friend told me that she's only two minutes away. So she should be arriving shortly. I think Danny's still sleeping because he hasn't texted me. Probably he'll wake up at like two o'clock. And we are in a neighborhood which we haven't seen before here in Berlin. Let me just check the name because I actually have no idea where it is. Everyone is like asking me for neighborhoods and I'm like, mm, like we just arrived three days ago. I have no idea what is what still. So we're close to... Jesus, I have no idea how to pronounce this. It's Reuterkies. <laughs> Probably I'm saying it completely wrong. I'll just show you how it looks like on the map. Yeah, so we're close to here. I have no idea. Oh, I see that the Karl Marx Street is closed. And I know that street because it was close to our place. Um, but the interior of this restaurant is so cute. We decided to... I decided to uh, sit outside. Uh, but I will also show you the inside once uh, we come in. Oh, I just see my friend. I'll catch up with you guys in a second. We just got the desserts, we got two cakes, they look really nice, we're going to try them. Let's see. Let's see. Yeah. Mm. It's really yeah. nice. It tastes so delicious. Mm -hmm. This one too, it's really nice. You guys have to come here. It's a really good restaurant.
phenomenal. Like the food is so good. You absolutely have to come here and try it because I'm telling you, I've never tasted better Asian food than here. Trying to find love in the city of gold Chic as fuck, they oh my god Killing me to death when I see those eyes Run until I find that face That drives me in with the body that shade Fine and curvy, but slightly dirty Can find an hour, but I'm on the journey Glamorous with the fashion sense of a goddess She a bad bitch with the finest, the hottest Cool cat, she just pipe it down, so exotic Sex machine, I swear was robotic I like it when she speak, but let's stop by the talking Like Red Fool, I'ma get this party rocking Classic kind of chick, yeah, you know what I mean Looking like a scene from a movie screen Beauty in the eyes she has Booty in the body it has She's a dining girl, not glass Ratchet girl, but she got glass I think I found my diamond girl That ruined my whole goddamn world I can't believe it's really you Hoping that you like me too I, I, See, you gotta keep your shades on Cause she's some good goods Hit me too strong She just sip a champagne and got me so gone Shawty with the attitude, she got it going on Falling love before the end of this song Lingerie all the way, you know what I say Give me that good in the city today Chilling rooftop, blue sky, whiskey on the rocks Time going by, ain't looking at the watch You ain't like a dove in the flock When I kiss you, man, it's fine Hi guys We are to the airport In the EU This means that we're finishing the vlog here we thank you for uh, participating on this journey. We're sure that you didn't enjoy it as much as we did, because that's impossible. So you have to come here. <laughs> so uh, don't be lame and book your tickets to Berlin. And like, comment, subscribe, and as Danny share, as Danny says. Like Kartoffen is trying to say, share it with your cousins. Share it with your cousins.